How much protein is too much protein? And how much should you be consuming in a day? Hi, I'm Maya Valenti with Naked Nutrition, a private chef and nutrition coach here to answer all of your questions around wellness and supplementation. An emphasis on protein is required for those looking to build muscle mass. And although it may seem relatively straightforward, loading up on protein immediately after a workout has its limits. In fact, your body might only be able to use a certain amount of protein in one sitting. Many people wonder, how much protein can your body absorb to maximize muscle gain? And is it possible to eat too much protein? Well, protein is an essential macronutrient that has been associated with benefits for weight loss and metabolic health. And because protein rich foods help people feel satisfied, it may cause them to consume less calories and therefore help support a healthy weight. Protein reduces your body's glaring levels, the hormone associated with hunger while also boosting the hormone peptide double Y, which helps you feel full. According to research, a high protein diet may help reduce overall calorie intake up to 441 calories per day. Protein is also essential in building and maintaining lean body mass. When you perform a strenuous exercise, such as weightlifting, your muscle fibers develop tiny tears from that resistance. And when you consume protein, your body breaks it down into amino acids, which are absorbed by your intestinal cells and then circulated through the bloodstream. The circulating amino acids are then distributed to the areas of need, such as those muscle tissue. These amino acids help to replenish and repair muscle tissues to be stronger and bigger. This process is known as MPS. And unlike carbohydrates, which can be stored as glycogen, the body is not able to store protein. Therefore, any extra protein that it cannot utilize is stored as fat. Protein requirements will vary by individual by the standard recommendation for most healthy adults. It is recommended to consume anywhere between 10 to 35% of total calories for protein. Therefore, any extra protein that it cannot utilize is either used for energy or stored as fat. Protein requirements will vary by individual, but the standard recommendation for most healthy adults is to consume anywhere from 10 to 35% of their total calories from protein. For example, if you consume a 2000 calorie diet, 200 to 700 calories should come from protein, which equals to about 50 to 170 grams a day. Another way to calculate protein is based on grams per kilogram of body weight per day. It is encouraged for most healthy adults to consume at least 0.8 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight, which equals to about 0.35 of protein per pound. If you are trying to build muscle mass, your protein needs are increased. In fact, during this time, the American College of Sports Medicine suggests consuming between 1.2 to 1.7 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight per day. Additionally, if you are trying to lose weight, it's important to prioritize protein to preserve lean body mass and target fat mass. Some research suggests that consuming 1.6 grams of protein per kilogram of body weight is beneficial for weight loss. So how much protein can your body absorb in one go? Most research suggests that the body best utilizes between 20 to 25 grams of protein at one time within a one to two hour period. Anything outside of that is believed to be used for energy or potentially stored as fat. And although further research on this is still warranted, studies suggest that there is a likely limited amount of protein that can be utilized during muscle protein synthesis. Instead of consuming all of your protein in one sitting after a workout, it is suggested that you're spreading that protein out throughout the day, typically over the course of four meals, which is best to optimize muscle gains and protein absorption. Not to mention spacing out your protein consumption is better for your digestive system as well. For example, consuming 0.4 grams per kilogram of body weight per meal across four meals would provide 1.6 grams of protein per kilogram per day spread across more evenly. This could potentially help ensure better utilization of those amino acids versus storing them as fat. Protein absorption is unlimited as your body will always be able to digest and circulate amino acids throughout your bloodstream despite the amount. However, how much protein your body can utilize to maximize muscle growth may vary. Some studies suggest protein utilization limits range from 20 to 25 grams per meal. However, much of this is still under research and will likely vary by individual. Although it's likely that your body will be able to use most of the amino acids from 30 grams of protein, it's not guaranteed that it will use all of it. Instead of driving yourself crazy wondering how much protein you should consume in one sitting, it's best to ensure that you're getting high quality, 
dietary protein, consuming high protein meals, and evenly distributing your protein intake throughout your day. More protein is not always better, and excess protein may lead to weight gain or other unpleasant side effects. So with proper nutrition and even supplementation, you should be able to reach your goals without overdoing it. As always, make sure to check us out at nakednutrition.com. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button for more informative videos like this one, because here at Naked Nutrition, we're nutrition with nothing to hide.